All right, so that's the management of Edelweiss talking about their uh, earnings. Uh, Somani Ceramics also came out uh, with a strong set of earnings. He spoke with Mr. Abhishek Somani, Joint Managing Director uh, at Somani Ceramics. And we began. I began by asking him uh, that the 30% jump that we saw in top line, how much was it because of additional capacity coming on board? Uh, how much was it because of price hikes? Little bit of both. Uh, I would like to clarify here that if you uh, compare the last year quarter three, there was an aberration uh, because last year quarter three, whole of December, the entire operations from Morbi for the entire tile industry had shut down. Therefore, this growth is looking uh, slightly higher than what normally would, would be. So uh, the 30%, although there is a growth and a little bit is because of capacity expansion which happened uh, this quarter. But a, but a lot of it is because last year, quarter three was very, very uh, stunted. So what was the volume growth that you saw in the third quarter? Yeah, so the Q3 volume growth is about 19.5 or 19.7 percent and about uh, eight and a half to nine percent has come from volume, uh, from value, sorry. So 19.7 percent was volume and uh, eight to nine percent was value. And Mr. Sumani, what kind of top line growth are you looking forward to achieve in this financial year? Oh yes, we're very confident the industry is doing well. Uh, there are uh, certain uh, hiccups which we've coming uh, for the industry. It's not for Sumani. Sumani has been outperforming any which ways and we will continue to outperform. So a 20% growth is what we are looking at uh, for the year end and also going forward, it's uh, somewhere around that figure would we would be maintaining for next year too. And what are the hiccups that you're talking about that you're probably foreseeing at this point in time? Uh, it has been, it, no, uh, the, the hiccups for the industry is that generally the scenario has been slow last quarter. So that's what I'm referring to. A uh, lot of uh, the holidays and also the general scenario in the building material industry, especially with the private builders, there has been slightly slower growth. And we do see that that's going to remain for the next quarter or so. It wouldn't affect so many because uh, we are taking market share from some of the competition. And also the brand has really playing uh, a, a more positive role and our value addition is taking more positive role. So as far as Sumani is concerned, I think we are a little uh, cushioned and alienated from what's happening in the industry to an extent. But uh, I'm talking purely for the industry. There is clearly a slower trend than what we saw last year. But with the, um, uh, uh, the RBI cutting down rates and hopefully we would see a little more rate cuts uh, over the next uh, month or so or quarter, this would start improving uh, the demand uh, cycle. So overall, it's looking good. It's looking very good. So what is the utilization rate at the expanded vitrified tile facility and the facility making wall tiles? Uh, I don't have the breakup uh, factory wise, but uh, overall our capacity utilization is above 90%. What are you planning to do with the surplus funds that you raised in February 2014 that have not been deployed yet? We are looking at uh, further expanding the sanitary wear capacity and we are also looking at another brownfield uh, uh, project to take place in either uh, the Gujarat plant or the uh, uh, Haryana plant. We yet to decide but this quarter we would be doing our uh, yearly uh, exercise and we'll probably come out with some solution uh, for, for you the next quarter. How did you manage the 130% jump that we've seen in profits? Uh, both of that, uh, I think later, most of it has come from the top line growth, but also our value added mix is substantially improved. So therefore the profit, the uh, PBT margins expansion uh, sequentially and even from quarter to quarter has uh, from quarter to quarter dramatically increased, but even sequentially we've gone up by 0.3%. Uh, so it's, 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 on, it's on account of the better value added product which we put into the market. Right, and what were your EBITDA margins this third quarter? The margins have gone up, in fact. It's gone up to 4.6 PBT from 4.3 sequentially and uh, from 3% last year, same quarter to 4.6. So I'm not sure what you're referring to. Uh, I just want to understand if these particular margins are sustainable going ahead and what's the outlook? So uh, whatever we end up with this year, uh, we are maintaining and we will keep maintaining a 0.5, 0 0.6% basis price basis point increase on PBT margins year on year. 
All right, so there you heard the management of Somani Ceramics talking about their numbers and the counter is seeing some amount of selling pressure today. It's down a little over 3% as we speak, very close to that lowest point of the day. We are slipping into a very short break right now. Don't go anywhere. We'll continue to take stock of various other stocks as well after that.